Beauty Fly and Spinder. Then the next one is Houndoom and the Guard of War. And no matter what, we're pretty much set. I think we're going to be able to do this section, but the next section is a questionable one. I thought I said Ebola for a second then. I thought I said Jesus. <laughs> Beauty Fly and Spinder. That's an okay star, but not an ideal one. I should have used Walrhine, but. If I'd have sent that war I need to use it to sell it first. It's going to be Fire Blast on. I'll just try Flamethrower. Flamethrower on Beauty Fly then, and the Psychic on Spin Deck. But like I say, if that misses, this is some BS going on. I'm not expecting it to take it out, but it did. Nice. Resellia. Now, so a psychic on Resellia will be an almost guaranteed one shot. Of course, we didn't use it on Resellia. Because I was not expecting it to be a one shot thingy. Of course. The typical red chunk. That's going to hit. I knew that would happen. I knew that would hit. But this game's bullshit. Take out a spin to the. Goodbye, why are we faster? Not spinning. Right weird phase when it gets hit. Didn't get a lot of experience for spinner, but whatever. Mm, sludge bomb, okay. That's gonna be a fa uh, fire flamethrower and a psychic. Uh, I was fully expecting that to be poisoned there. We got a surprise again. This was an easy battle, anyway. Wow, okay. The next one is. Well, it's water, water, electric, electric. But one of them is. Well, it's magneton, one of them, so we could use Handoom for it. But of course, I don't want to send Handoom out first, with the risk of um, the water ones both coming out first. It's a hard one, this is. Um, I definitely want Jolty on first. God of War probably is a safe option. Yeah, God of War is a safe option here. They've both got electric attacks, so they've also got um, psychic attack. Well, God of War has got psychic attack as well. You've really got to get the brain going now. <laughs> so we've got a Goldock and an Ampharos, which is about what we expect it to be. I'm just I'm assuming there might be a rain, rain dance thunder combo going here, but you never know. So I'm assuming that, so I'm going to go for a thunder and a psychic. I was wrong, but it still hit, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> will it kill it? Yes, it will. Lovely. We're getting some lucky hits. It's the Gorbus. Psychic. Psychic. Yeah, I'm not expecting this to take Amphros out. No. <laughs> not even close. Thunder, that's going to hit. Because yeah. they near moves never miss. Absolutely never miss. Oh, this is BS. Every time they use an attack, it's a poison or, like, or paralyzes it. Thunder. Yep, that hit. Wow. We're getting lucky here. <laughs> yeah, this battle get, is a, a lucky one for us. I'm not expecting all these attacks to take them out in one shot, but it does. Mm -hmm. defense is shite. I just realised that. Physical defense is dreadful. Mm -hmm. Now we could do with um, Houndoom out. But I knew that was going to happen. I just knew that was coming. Wow, it missed. Right, so I ain't got a lot of options. <laughs> but we're going to fun. Ah, oh, well, well, double kick Amphos to make sure, and we shall psychic magnet home. Yeah. Lovely jubbly. We are getting close to the final battle. 
but and he missed. Jesus, we're getting lucky. <laughs> Not very effective. I expected that. We did a lot of damage. Huh? Thunder. I'm always scared that these are going to Volt Absorb, but I guess we'll find out. Okay, it doesn't. Still did a lot of damage. Thunder. That's never going to make it miss that often. No! First catch of Tear the Ball. The next one is all grass, so the next ones are really easy. Good nursery. Good, good, good. That was an interesting scene. I'm not sure why I sent out this ring then, but it doesn't matter really. Double kick and every break. Yeah, see ya. I did not know that I was super effective. I thought that'd be not very effective. There you go. A little wrinkle in the arse, as I say. Level 52. The more levels, the better before we get annihilated, which is going to happen at some point. I think he's a good one for the next one. God of War again. Got up one hound doing perfect matchup for the next one. Oh, didn't mean to do that. Just double check the items again. What we got? Just double checking. And charcoal, yeah. The Ursa Ring should have be a black belt for fighting. I don't think we're going to need him for the next one. Uh, yeah, I think that's about our best setup. So let's -a go. Three more to go to. We've done the area which I didn't think we'd actually do. So, oh god, Kermungian ochre. Some floor and bar plume. That is perfect. Riding that fire blast doesn't miss. This will be a should be a double knockout. God of war. God of war. Uh, fire Blast that is 100% going to miss, but we're still going to try it. Oh, it didn't. I was about to say, yeah, I knew it. <laughs> well, nope, it hit. And yes, it was a knockout. As I fully expected it to be. It should be super effective, but I don't know if he'll take it out. One health. One HP. That's going to synchronize anyway. Paralyze the bar plume as well. He's telling me to stand up. Go. Flame for might go over flame for on the uh, on. Um, I'm gonna actually, I'm gonna psychic loom because I'll definitely be taken out. Maybe for a vile plume. And go flat. <laughs> I think he gets sat on. Sunny day. Well, that just helps me. That's, that thing is building up to a solar beam, that is. Of course. Miss. Oh no. Well, this is guaranteed death. Yeah, see ya. I think our next, next one is going to be probably Ursa Ring and um, Ursa Ring and the Hound Doom. Yeah, the final battle is going to be insane on for this one. So, Ursaring and Houndoom. I don't know why I just did that. Ursaring for this one. I think it's got Faint Attack, hasn't it? Yes, it does. I'm going to give him Black Glasses for this one. Because three of the four Pokemon it's about to fight are Psychic. So, let's give it the Black Glasses. Where is it? There we go. Black Glasses. Can't see if we're looking. Perfect. Should be all good to go. 69 for the number, so let's get it done and dusted. Casual guy Ebzor on the funny number. Giraffe and Curly the first one. 
Uh, that draft figure is the only one that isn't psychic type. What is it? I'm not sure now, I can't remember. Yeah, so we... it should, this should be really easy, this battle. Paint attack on Giraffe Rig and Shadow Ball on Curlia. I'll say, if that misses, I should have probably given um, Thingy, uh, Houndoom, to get the spell tag on this one. Increase the ghost ability or well, whatever. Doesn't seem to make a difference. Abracadabra. He's a Nephilim lover. I don't know what that was. Interesting. Yeah, so we can use Faint Start. Let's see how much damage this does. And kaboom. That did not do a lot. <laughs> um, I don't know what to do now. Um, return on Kadabra. I might just return Giraffery and Shadow Ball Kadabra. Oh, no reflect. Is that the physical one or the special defense one? Oh, it's defense. That's not too bad. Goodbye, Kadabra. Yeah, I was I was half expecting it to land stopping the red then. Well nope. It was annihilated. Oh, have a look for Hound Doom. Decent attack. Special defense is dreadful. The attack's okay. Use a Luna Dome. I think we're going to definitely stick with Houndoom to start the next battle off, but in regards to what else we're going to use, I have no idea. Got two fire and three psychics. I don't know if that did just as much damage as the paint that did. <laughs> um, we'll do Alder Muzzle if you break each other. This has been a sweep, nearly. And kaboom. That did not do a lot, okay. Die beam. Ow. Of course it crits. And confused. What a load of bullshit. All it does to make it harder is just makes secondary effects uh, pro proc off more often. Only way it makes it harder. Bullshit. Oh. I didn't realise that's what I actually would do as well. Take down Lunatone then. The rookie break and the Shadow Ball. Hmm. Bit of a tank that Lunatone. Rush defense fell. Doesn't it? Well, one of them's down and it's not. Yeah. If it is, it's not going to use it on Hard Doom, is it? So, bye! That's what I'm the next one, Dark Glass of Simba, seems to be nine. So I think for the next one, we're going to put um, the white scarf on, I believe. I think, yeah, someone, something. I don't know. It might have a bit of an effect on, say, Espeon. No, um, Hound Doom and Typhlosion, that's about it. We'll see, anyway. <laughs> Lovely jubbly, that was quite an easy one before the next one, which is going to get insane. So I'm going to have to use Houndoom. It's just a second Pokemon I don't know what to go with. I'm tempted with a wall ride. Because then if it's either the fire ones, we're good. Um, ooh, this is a tough one here. Alright, swap his eye about first. Alright, can we give? Um, Black Belt, Fighting Types. Um, Spell Tag. Why is the white silk scarf the normal? Yeah, we'll give him that. I might, I might, I think the bet might be just the best option to send out Dragonite. So, yeah, Dragonite and Houndoom. Let's do this. I'm going to save here. Because if we get annihilated, I can try again. Save me having to do the whole thing, and that's basically game. I can just try again. Here we go, right. Number 70. Let's do this. Area leader Noken. Let's be on a God of War. That is not a good start. But it didn't send out either of the fire ones, but. Should be able to deal with this. Again, I should have probably put the spell tag on Houndoom, and I didn't. 
But that was a mistake. Right, okay, so I think we're going to start off with... Ah, uh, God of what? Okay, I should have gone for SPL. Should have bought. Which this does. Didn't expect these to be one to one shot, dude. Who's that? Ice punch? Oh dear. <sighs> Fuck's sake. What are the odds of that thing having ice punch? What a joke. Jolty on then. Looks you should go first now. First and second. Let's try Thunder in a Shadow Ball then. Use Thunder. Missed. Oh, this is getting stupid already. Life screen. That's special defense. No, okay. It says it raises it by a little bit. I bet God of War survives this. No, it didn't. Okay. Hey. <laughs> oh, what we got? Alakazam. Okay, definitely focus Alakazam on it. No, no, no. Uh, let's focus Espeon, because obviously it's got the boost stats. That did nothing! All it did was one calm mind, and it boosts it up by to like max. That's ridiculous. That did a ridiculous amount of damage. Hello, ball. Wow. Okay. <laughs> so, well, we'll double kick to guarantee the kill. Well, Thunderbolt do, won't it? Thunderbolt and Shadow Ball. Thunderbolt and Shadow Ball. Thunderbolt and Shadow Ball. Goodbye. That's a spill down. There's Typhlosion or Hound in the next one. For the Typhlosion first. Psychic. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, 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 dun. Well, that hurt. Go with the wall ride. No. Shadow Ball. Dun, dun. Oh my god, as if! As if! It was quick attack. <laughs> I did a lot. Alright, fun. Why have you all got these ridiculous punches that always do a thousand damage and nearly one shot? Us? That's uh, uh, Algazam down. Guy, was late. Warples. Isn't that Houndy? Oh, of course, I forgot about Houndy. Warples. Did it so much damage this does? Not a lot. Okay. Well, I'm definitely gonna, I'm um, I'm gonna sacrifice my houndy <laughs> earthquake, and then I'm gonna heal up. Um, right. I'm gonna sacrifice my own houndy, unless of course it doesn't. Oh dear. Okay, that could be a problem. Punch. As I say, if that had took it out, then I'd have absolutely rage quit. And that's going to kill my hand and do nothing to theirs. I can see it coming. Well, that's it. This will do nowhere near as much of that damage to that. Okay, maybe it did. <laughs> okay, it does do a decent amount of damage. That would have killed that if it was for the life screen. Now, I'm going to have to heal up her uh, wall round again. Now, that should be GG. Maybe not. Because these have always got ridiculous attacks. That's got to be on Warride. 
I bet he crit. Oh no. Weird. Mm -hmm. what about, whatever I throw out is going to get hit by an earthquake. So, it's got to be what uh, sorry, This is a tank. Use the crank. Do, 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 do. That flosion down. Yeah, that didn't do a lot to us, Ring. Boom. Lovely, jubbly. Area done. Wow. I was not expecting that. And the next one isn't that much more difficult. I've got a thousand odd XP for that. Wow, okay. Well, we might get a bit further on than I thought we would on this one. The next one are very mixed, the parties, the battle parties are. And they're starting to get legendaries. <laughs> so this is where it's going to get a little bit ridiculous. Yeah, because one of the next ones in the next area um, has, has Reggie Ice <laughs> and Articuno. So, yeah. I don't know what we get for this reward. TM4, don't know what that is. Oh, quick look. Uh, so, quick look. See what we couldn't see what that was. Can't mind. Wow, what a waste. Uh, okay, there's not really a lot of over overheat, but sharp and low special, so we're not going to do that. Well, anyway, we got to the end of that one. So, if you enjoyed this part, don't forget to push the like button, leave a comment down below, or subscribe to this channel for my Twitter. always down below. It's been next and I'll see you in the next Pokemon XD Gale of this video. Thank you so much for watching.